So guys, I strongly believe in creating new traditions. New Christmas traditions, new things on the table. I like to try a new dish every Christmas season. And when I invited this guy on the show, he told me about a rice that he has been doing. And I just got excited. And I am looking forward to trying this recipe Christmas morning at home. So the first thing I'm going to do before I introduce the gentleman is start with two cups of rice. He told me two cups of rice. I want to thank the folks at Lotus for making it possible. Locally produced rice, guys. And one of the things with rice that you probably may not know, for those of you who may not know, don't wash your rice out. All the vitamins are actually right here in the rice. Don't wash your rice out. Locally produced rice. Thanking the folks at Lotus for making it possible. I'm going to get my rice boiling. And I'm going to introduce to you my first guest on the show. He is one half of Rendalina Reviews. His name is Randall Robinson. <laughs> my brother, my brother. Welcome. Thanks for having me. I put your rice, your rice, your rice boiling. You, you did not do that today. We had some rice over here. You boiled your rice already? Yeah, yeah. I mean, and I, and I kind of washed my rice too now, so you, I guess I learned something. <laughs> you learned something now? Yeah. So you have your rice ready? Mm -hmm. So this rice, tell me the quick story on this rice. This is a, this is not no ordinary rice. This yeah, is um, Rendell rice, I understand. Yeah. So how, how did this rice come about, this famous rice? Well, I love to cook. Right. I cook a lot for um, friends and family. Nice. And when I met my mother-in-law, I would always cook rice for her. And she'd be like, what well, happened? Is only rice you could cook? Is Rendell rice? And well, the name stuck. I mean, I don't like the name too much, but Rendell rice? It's Rendell rice. I, I find it have a little ring to it, man. So this was the rice you cooked for your mother, no? Mm-hmm. And the bonus in this rice is that there is... It's, it's, it's basically saltfish rice. It's saltfish rice. It's like rice. a saltfish vegetable rice, but Rendell rice. Rendell rice. Melina, ate this rice when you all were dating? <laughs> yes, yes. <laughs> <laughs> and she's eating now, too? She's eating now, too? Yeah, yeah, yeah. She has continued eating it throughout the marriage. Mm -hmm. And that answers all the questions you need to know about Rendellina reviews. R Rendell and Melina as a couple eating saltfish rice. Mm -hmm. Let's go. Let's. I want to make this rice okay. for Christmas. Let's all right, go. nice. Well, these ingredients are really easy to find. It's nothing too fancy. It's like a normal fried rice. Right. Right? So you have your carrots, your corn, your green peppers, garlic, ginger, parsley, um, some pimentos, pepper, mm. and some um, garlic butter, mm. and your normal seasoning, salt, and stuff. Right, and of course your saltfish. Right, so you right? prepare your saltfish, you boil your saltfish. Right, boil so your everything is already prepared. We don't cut up everything already. We're not time to waste. Nice. Right, so you're just adding in about a half cup of garlic butter. Right, get that in. I like, I like the garlic butter base to start. Yeah. Because you know you have to flavor the pot. Nice. Right, so you're just having it on low heat and you're just melting it out a little bit. Now we are adding in your carrots, right? You're using this as the flavor base, I like to say. Nice. Right? Now what you want to look for is like you're trying to get the pot golden, right? So this have to simmer for like about five to 10 minutes. So what you're looking for, you're seeing this gold and this again from the carrot here. And it's not, it's not a smell as you say. Yes, yeah, it's and it's smell. oozing out of it. Nice. Yeah, so you just add in your next ingredient. Your corn. Nice. Right? And it's the same process again. You're just trying to get all the juices out of the corn. And a very important part, you're putting in some salt. Now you're adding peppers, pimentos and you know your normal pepper sauce your favorite pepper sauce well it's not my favorite but <laughs> it's what i was able to do <laughs> <laughs> but you use your favorite pepper sauce <laughs> you make it render rice right <laughs> uh, right and now you're adding your aromatics celery garlic garlic and ginger Whoa. yeah and um some bell peppers. All right, I like to add these after because you know I still want to get the crunch from these veggies. 
And I think I just like bell peppers. I, like all I love bell peppers, you know? No. Yeah, it's really my ma pizza, which is, I don't know. Right. And I love pizza too. <laughs> no boy like me, like the same thing. I, I, lo I love a pizza, yeah. When we add in my secret ingredient. Yeah, we add in that. Last. Last. Nice. Right? Well, I guess you had a real good time in because you had to add that. No. no. Yeah, right. wow. Yeah, okay. yeah, yeah. I know about swordfish. He's a swordfish pro. Okay, okay. Yeah. He's a, a, a swordfish pro. A swordfish pro. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, okay, okay, yeah. okay. Is, he, uh, is that man who like a crown on the set, I think? Nah, like a plain. Oh. Yeah. Plain? Yeah, Joel Swordfish Villa Partner. That's what I'm Oh my god. And I don't know why I haven't thought about putting swordfish and rice because it, it, it really knows. Yeah, it's simple. It's simple. It's simple. simple. But it's, I'm sure it's so flavorful because mm -hmm. saltfish flavor. I'm thinking of this already flavor. Yeah, I mean, you're smelling that. You're with smelling the boom and with the veggies and, mm -hmm. and yeah, everything. Yeah, good to go Yeah, man. Right, so um, uh, what I usually do is I add a little bit of seasoning salt. Right. Right? Um, this contains uh, like uh, onion powder, garlic powder, you know? Like our purple seasoning kind, yeah, of, yeah. kind of thing. Right, just a little, a little thing for mm -hmm. taste. Mm -hmm. Right, and then after you add in. You add in your rice. You add in your lotus rice. Mm -hmm. You're doing it, putting it on low heat. And you just kind of fold everything in together. Mm -hmm. I'm smelling these waffles right now. What, what, uh, I mean, where you want to smell it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is Randall's Saltfish Rice. Mm -hmm. The new Christmas rice in TNT. You can eat this by itself. Right. You can add meat, salad, whatever, you know. You could play any role yeah, yeah. in your diet. Right, and we just about done there. And I don't know about you, but I, I want to taste this rice. I saw how much you want. <laughs> yeah, that's a trick question. Or? <laughs> <laughs> right, so this guy, that, 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 that's a trick question. Or? I'm watching it. I'm watching it. Yeah, thank you, brother. All right. Yeah, it's a good taste. Thank you, thank you, thank you. We eat together. There you go. Oh, thanks for having me. Cheers, bro. Yeah. Cheers, bro. Thank you very much. Yeah. For coming and sharing the recipe with no, us. No, thanks for inviting me. I can eat this all day, every day. I would have never thought of just putting swordfish in a rice dish. It's simple. Mm -hmm. And very flavorful. Mm -hmm. Yeah, guys, so this is your new rice for Christmas morning. Try Randall's recipe. Very, very simple. Check it on coppertoecaribbean.com. Mm -hmm. Randall, quickly tell me about Randall in the reviews. Um, you guys kind of just go countrywide and, 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 and review different places. Mm -hmm. Tell me a little bit about what you, how, how you guys do. Well, Randall in our reviews mm -hmm. as a husband and wife team, mm -hmm. we go off to interesting places in Trinidad and Tobago and interview interesting people about the interesting things they do, right? We we love like unique dishes, we like innovation, so we always seek out those things. And as that we realize over the years we've amassed a bit of a following and people trust the places we go and they look out for our new videos. Check yeah. out check out Rendelina Reviews. That that's that's the tab on social yeah, media. Yeah, Rendelina Reviews. Facebook, Instagram. Everything. TikTok. Everything. Where the new one come out? The new yes, one? TikTok. TikTok yeah. is the new one. Yeah, Pinterest, TikTok, everything. Pinterest, every, everything. Yeah. At everything. Rendelina Reviews, some fantastic reviews. They, they really go neck all corners and crevices of the country and give you some wonderful reviews. Thank mm -hmm. you very much, Randall. Mm -hmm. No problem, man. Mm -hmm.